thought of cherishing. Our next performer up here is a, he's a world traveler. He's a storyteller. He's a song interpreter. He takes life and it, and it just uh, comes out in the greatest form. And proud to call St. Petersburg, Florida home. Welcome right here to the porch stage, Roy Bookbinder. to be back here on the Swanee River. I don't know if it would ever happen. We got time for another one. This is one off the newest album called The Good Book. Didn't have that here last time I was here. The name of this song is uh, been worse. You know my good guy left with another man. Won't be missing her raising sand. She ain't good looking and she don't dress fine. A girl can't cook and she's always lying. Could have been worse they say. Could have been worse you know. Could have been worse just wait. Yeah, could have been worse you'll see. don't like me and she told me so in my business she sticks her nose where well, she'll pop in doesn't have a clue catch us doing the dippity do could have been worse they say could have been worse you know could have been worse just wait could have been worse you'll see her whiskey and she likes her wine. She's smoking these here reefers all the time. She gets so high, can't hardly stand and she can't remember. I'm her man. Could have been worse, they say. Could have been worse, you know. Yeah. Who's doing who to what, where and when? Can't keep a mouth shut, that's for sure. She hears some trash, she just wants some more. Could have been worse, they say. Could have been worse, you know. Yeah, could have been worse, just wait. Could have been worse, you see. 
Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh, baby. That's a good one, isn't it? Well, let's see here. I play the St. Pete Blues. I've been living in St. Pete for, uh, ooh, me and the new wife. Uh, been there for about 20 years plus. She ain't so new anymore. <laughs> on the road in my bus for 16 and a half years and took a lot of getting used to living in a house and uh, started to get pretty used to it but sometime I get the St. Pete Blues. Get your ups and you get your downs, that's what it takes to make a fool go around. I said, hey baby, you ain't so such much you know, Ooh, I'm going back down south. I'm gonna leave all this rain, sleep cold and snow. Don't look back, mama, you might not like what you see. Oh, you're scheming and you're dreaming, never set your poor heart free. Hey, hey, baby, you ain't so such much you know. I'm going back down to St. Pete, Florida. Leave all this rain, sleep cold and snow. Is that authorized video you're shooting here, pal? She have a badge on her, so it tells me it's authorized. I'm trying to sell videos and make a living here. Mama said, Papa, Daddy, you just wait and see. I said, hey, hey, baby. You ain't so such much, you know. That's right, you know where I'm going. Don't ask me no questions. I won't tell you no lies. I'm a hard-pushing Papa, Mama, and I can't be satisfied. Like I said, I'm a hard pushing popper. I can't be satisfied. Hey, hey, baby. Ooh, mama, you ain't so such much. You know that's right. I'm going back down to St. Pete, Florida. I'm going to be all of this rain, sleet, cold, and snow. I didn't write this one. It's a good song. It was originally recorded by Blind Boy Fuller. It was up, uh, from around, up around Durham. He was friends with the Reverend Gary Davis, who wasn't a reverend back then. He was a hell-raising blues man. 
time I met him, he had calmed down some. Run to get you one gal, better get two. One for your buddy and one for you. I got a wife, I got a sweetheart too. I hope my wife don't want me when my sweetheart do. You better rag mama. You better rag mama. Ooh, you better rag mama. I said, come on, girl. You know, I'm going uptown with my hat in my hand. I'm looking for a woman, ain't got no man. Like looking for a needle lost in the sand. Come on, John, do that rag. One for the money, two for the show. Three to get ready, say, go, cat, go. Come on and shake that thing. in the sand. One said, Mama, I wish you was a man. Look here, girl, stop raising sand. Turn it on over. I'll do the best I can. You better rag, Mama. You better rag, Mama. Ooh, baby. I got a gal, she like to fuss and clown. She can look up as long as I can look down. She might have good look and then she brings me luck. She's a sweet little gal and she sure likes to rag, Mama. Ooh, baby, come on, girl, let's do that rag. One for the money, two for the show, three to get ready, say, go, cat, go. Come on, girl, let's shake that thing. If you don't play, you surely can't win. You better rag, mama. I'm looking for a gal, time to sleep by myself. Come on, girl. Better rag, mama. You better rag, mama. Now listen, it was the night before Christmas and all through the house. Not a creature stirred, not a single mouse out in the yard. There was a great big crash and Santa Claus falling on his big fat. I said, rag, baby. You better rag, mama. Come on and rag, mama. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well, it's good to be back. It's good to be back. I, I found my way up here. I hadn't been here for five years. You know. Uh, I worked with uh, Beth and Randy for about 16, 15, 16 years, and then uh, the new guys took it over, and I, I gave them a break and did the first year. I shouldn't have done that because they never called me back. <laughs> so usually I'd be home in St. Pete doing nothing this weekend. So this is really wonderful to get to see all the old friends and the old musicians. And uh, <laughs> Lord have mercy. Back on the Swanee. Yeah, boy. Yeah, I'll do another song. There's another one that's on my new album. The Good Book. You can get that at the, down that green fence there. I've got the new wife sitting there selling CDs. Having a welcome back Swanee River specials. CDs are going to be $10 a piece. We got four or five different ones. If you want more than that, you have to come by my Sprinter tour bus because I have all my CDs there. I got 12 different ones and I got my DVDs. I got one DVD here. And I'm doing the guitar workshop tomorrow. If you want to learn how to do this, it'll fix you up in an hour. You'll be, be a champ. In an hour, I can, I can help create the illusion that you're pretty good. A couple of tricks. Teach you that one. Well, 
What you gonna do when your baby says you're gonna pack up and go? What you gonna do when the girl you love says she doesn't want you no more? Well, you can run, you can hide, you can catch a freight train. The life that you was leading is never gonna be the same. What you gonna do? I told you. What you gonna do? You're down on your luck. You got your money on a pony, won't run. What you gonna do? You're down to your last buck, man. You know that you, you, you just can't buy no more fun. Though it should have happened, you know it would have been. You know it could have got there, but your pony didn't win. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? You get a call from the bank, get out the house, you live and ain't your home. Yeah, what you gonna do? They take your automobile, they leave you out on the streets all alone. You can tell your mom, you can tell your pa, but they never want to see you back in Arkansas. What you gonna do? That's my little Ray Charles thing in there. I saw Ray Charles when I was 14 years old. What a moment that was. Not for him, for me. It was June of 1979. I got to play the Tampa Theater with Ray. Got to hang out with Ray Charles. Dream come true. Totally inappropriate, but a uh, great gig for me. Yeah, what you gonna do when your baby said you're gonna pack up and go? What you gonna do when a girl you love says she don't want you no more? You can run, you can hide, you can catch a freight train, but the life that you was leading is never gonna be the same. What you gonna do? Yes, what you gonna do? You come to find out that your baby's been stepping out on you. What you gonna do? You finally see the light, you realize you never had a clue. She used to drive you all day, she used to ride you all night. The girl used to, so now she don't do nothing but fuss and fight. What you gonna do? Yeah, what you gonna do when your baby says you're gonna pack up and go? Thank you very much, appreciate it. Back in the 60s, there was a fabulous folk music scare, you might remember it. Folk music was booming and then the blues caught on and they, they boomed along with the folk music. Back then all they had was folk festivals. There was no such thing as a bluegrass festival. Bill Monroe and Earl Scruggs, they played the Newport Folk Festival, the Philly Folk Festival. Yeah, and that was the beginning of all that jazz. Buddy Waters played the Newport Jazz Festival in 58. I wasn't there, but uh, I could have been. I'd have lived up there, but I didn't. I did get to see Chuck Berry at 50, in 1957, though. And, and Buddy Holly three times. I should have grown up to be a rock and roller, but uh, this is all I can do, so I'm doing it. During the great, during the great folk music scare, a lot of people went down south, the uh, Yankees, I was a Yankee. Uh, still a fan of the New York Yankee baseball team, but uh, what can you do? What you going to do? Uh, let's see where I was going with that. Oh, Mississippi John Hurt, they found him down in Mississippi. Whoa. Well, like, really? The fellas had a 78 RPM record. Avalon's my hometown. And said the, the guy doing the music was Mississippi John Hurt, college boys. When they sobered up, they were halfway to Avalon. They found him. Still played the guitar exactly like he did in 28. Hadn't learned a new guitar lick. I really respect that. John Hurt played kind of like this.
Keep a knocking, but you can't come in. Keep a knocking, but you can't come. Keep a knocking, but you can't come in. Come back tomorrow night, try it again. Come back tomorrow night. I know you love me, but you. I know you love me, but you can't come in. Keep knocking, but you can't come in. Come back tomorrow night, try it again. Come back tomorrow night, try it again. Drinking gin, I know we've been out of love of men. Keep a knocking, but you can't come in. Come back tomorrow night. Come back tomorrow night. Come back tomorrow night, try it again. Come back tomorrow night, try it again. In the village back in the 1960s, I got out of the Navy in 65. I was hanging out in my Greenwich Village scene. It was a little late. Dylan had already moved to Woodstock. People often ask me, did, did you get to hang with Dylan? I said, actually, he'd already moved to Woodstock, and at this point, it's his move. But I haven't heard from him. Anyway, this song here, uh, uh, Dylan, before I got to the village, was sleeping on Dave Van Rock's couch on, uh, uh, I forget what street he was on. He ended up on Sheridan Square, but uh, Dave Van Ronk's wife managed Dave Van Ronk and Bob Dylan before Dylan got his record deal with Columbia. But uh, Dave used to do this old song by Blind Blake. Blind Blake was actually from Newport News, Virginia, we found out recently. Everybody thought he was from Florida, but uh, it wasn't so. Anyway. Blind Blake played kind of like this. Cabaret. She said, pretty papa, you're going my way. She was uh, mad to know what it was all about. The girl took me home just to kick me out. She broke my nose, split my chin. Said she didn't want me round again. She chased me out through the kitchen, into the hall. Beat me with a chair till my head got sore. But that'll never happen no more. No, that'll never happen no more. I said, that, that's right, never happened. That'll never happen no more. Where the eagle on the dollar said, God, we trust. I'm looking for a woman that I can trust. That'll never happen no more. Lived in Chicago in the winter and fall. Told me to wear my overalls. I got broke. It wasn't my fault. I was using pork chops without no salt. I met a sweet little gal with a big, big coat. Cadillac car, she had a 40-foot boot. She pulled a gun, took my dough. I didn't holler in, I didn't get sore, but that, 
never happen no more. What? That'll never happen no more. Apples on the table, pieces on the shelf. Ooh, I'm looking for a new gal. I'm tired of sleeping by myself. Good that'll never happen no more. No, that'll never happen no more. Met a gal at a cabaret, race, said, pretty papa, you going my way? She was mad to know what it was all about. The girl took me out, just to kick me out, broke my nose, split my chin. She said she didn't want me hanging around again. The girl chased me to the kitchen, into the hall. She beat me with a chin till my head got sore. That's right, that'll never happen no more. Talk to me. That'll never happen no more. I used to dance with a gal that called Cherry Red When I got through boogie, the fool felt dead Never, oh, that'll never happen I mean, that'll never happen no more I said, that will never happen no more Do you know the one from the new album? This song is called Step Right Up. A lot of people in North Florida and South Georgia used to work in medicine shows up in the Carolinas. They traveled around the country selling uh, cure-alls. Today we call them drugs, but they had cure-alls and nice bottles with labels. And uh, uh, Pink Anderson, my old friend, I met him. He made uh, two records in 28, 1928, that is. He wished he could be here tonight, but uh, he's dead. He told me he went on the road with uh, C.W. Blair's Medicine Show in 1911. He worked with him for 18 seasons, then he switched over to uh, Dr. Kerr's Medicine Show. Worked for him for like 26 years. The guy he had a good work record, you know. And his job, uh, at the end, uh, the last 30 years or so, he, he was working with a sidekick, uh, his best, best friend, Peg Leg Sam. And, and their job at the Medicine Show was to drag the streets of the small town the music and the excitement, bring them down to where the doctor was on a flatbed wagon or a truck eventually selling the dope. And uh, they, they could draw a crowd anywhere because Pink played the guitar and, and, and sang and Peg uh, played the harmonica and danced. I mean, if you've never seen a peg leg man dance, you're missing something, baby. I actually knew three peg legged men that were all professional dancers. Cross my heart and hope to die. The most famous one you can Google. Yeah, he ended up, uh, he was in motion pictures in the 20s, dancing down spiral staircases in front of stair movies with his partner, not Ginger Rogers, but uh, they were dancing down that spiral, tuxedos into the peg, it was incredible. And uh, he ended up being a, a famous guy in the, in the 50s when Dean Martin and uh, Jerry Lewis broke up with the singer, Dean Martin, and he was doing solo comedy shows. He always had, uh, uh, Peg Leg Bates and his dancing partner opened up the shows. He had a thing for, for Peg Leg Bates. And uh, they were building vaudeville as three legs in a peg. And boy, they could pack them in. I mean, there were some dancers. I mean, before I left New York City, Peg Leg Bates was teaching tap at the new school for social research. That's like a real snazzy school. The name of my record company is Peg Leg Records. People ask me why. I said, I knew three Peg Leg dancers. You can't make it up. But anyway, getting back to the medicine show, some of you might remember the, uh, there was over in Tarpon Springs over there somewhere, there was a, a, a retirement village for primates. Bob and, Bob and May Noel. They, they had a, a, they were the monkeys. Now they grew up in medicine shows. Their parents were medicine show doctors or Indian chiefs. Medicine shows were really run by Indian chiefs or doctors. I don't know if they were really Indian chiefs. Probably not. Probably weren't doctors either. But they wanted to get out of the medicine show business and they got in the monkey business. They had, they had a monkey show that toured the country for 34 years. They'd get to town and put up a big sign, wanted town tough to wrestle with the monkey. If you pin his shoulders down for three seconds, you get a $50 bill. That was big money in the 40s. I mean, I'd give it a shot now. They toured all over, and they had a chimpanzee. Nobody in the 40s ever seen a chimpanzee. They didn't know what the blankety blanket was. I almost said a bad word. 
family festival. But uh, nobody knew that they charge everybody a quarter to see the town tough get beat up by the chimpanzee. Everybody go there hoping, you know, they set up the tent and the show would start. And they all happened in a cage. And, and nobody realized that the monkey knew nothing about wrestling. He was trained from birth to pull men's trousers down. <laughs> They retired in Tarvin Springs, made a million selling their property eventually. It's, now it's a research center. But anyway, uh, I was supposed to go out with Chief Thunderclouds Medicine Show in the spring of 1970. Pink Anderson and Peg Leg Sam, long story, we got Pally. And they, they said, will you go out with the Chief? I said, yeah, what the heck, I'll do it. I didn't even ask how much they were paying. And that winter, Pink called me up, he said, the tour is off. I said, what happened? He said, the Chief. I said, what happened to the Chief? He said, his heart attacked him. I said, what? He said, he's dead. I said, oh, I see. Too bad. But anyway, I wrote this song for all the medicine show people. It's called Step Right Up. Some of you might remember Diamond Teeth Mary. She gets a mention in my song. She worked in the medicine shows and the minstrel shows. She's on the new album featuring Frank Bowman on the clarinet. And uh, a little lap steel by Damon Fowler. intro so I can remember the first verse. <laughs> you might think this is a hard way to make a living. It's not that hard, but it ain't easy. Step right up, folks. You just got to see the magnificent, magical, mysterious menagerie. It'll amaze, it'll amuse, it'll arouse and astound. No doubt the most bodacious show in this here town. Pack up your sorries, kiss away your cares. You won't have to worry no more. If you're tired and run down and life ain't worth living no more You can't hardly drag yourself out of bed like before You got no health, no vitality, no vigor, no zest The Chief's Indian Remedy elixir's the best Don't hesitate, you don't want to be late Get there before it's all gone, yeah! Got a hot clarinet break here on the record, I'm doing the best I can Nice! Listen, you gotta drink it neat, that's right, it ain't too sweet. Before long you'll be back one more. The chief will make you believe, the doc ain't there to deceive. And the story that he weaves will relieve you of some of your pain and all of your chains. But you'll be glad that you came to the show. Step right up, folks, you just got to see. The magnificent, magical, mysterious menagerie, that's right, it will amaze, it will amuse, arouse and astound. No doubt the most bodacious show in this town. Pack up your sorries, kiss away your cares. You won't have to worry no more. They got a peg-legged dancer and an Indian chief. A blue singing lady with diamonds in her teeth. Why, they got them a two-headed turtle man, you just gotta see it. They got a chicken that can count to ten, no lie, John. Follow them down to the free show tonight. You don't want to miss it begin. So I said, step right up, folks. You just got to see the magnificent, magical, mysterious menagerie. Yeah. It's sure Cherie Bob. There's a lot of words there. Don't leave. I'm going to do something about Garth Brooks in a minute. Don't leave. Don't leave. I will now play you for the Kentucky Blues. It's actually a Texas Blues song written by Little Hat Jones, who actually never wore a little hat. I was down there in Texas, and they somebody met somebody who knew Little Hat Jones, and he said they actually had a very big head. The hat was normal size. I was taking notes in those days. He was from Seguin, Texas. I said, whilst we was here having fun, the Lord jumped up and said, nobody run. Well, I'm long gone from Kentucky. I'm long gone. Got away lucky and I left the keen. I'll be gone like a submarine. You know, my women put the honey on the wedding's a bit. Said, don't let them kill Bookbinder. 
did yet Said don't you worry mama cause it won't be long I'm gonna leave you here baby sing your worried song And I left the key and I'll be gone like a submarine I don't play the dozen, neither the tens. If you keep on talking, going to ease you in. Keep on talking, going to make me mad. I'm going to tell about the mothers that your father. I said I don't play the dozens. I declare, man, and neither the tens. Come to Santa Fe, passing and flying. Y'all see me reached up to grab the blind. Another long gone from Kentucky. I'm another long gone. Got away lucky. I left the game like a submarine. For six o'clock in the morning till half past seven the next afternoon. Why the Popeye man run so fast? Fire did come from his heels and burned up the cotton, his scorched the corn, and might as well have drove to the farmer's field. He was a traveling man. Certainly was a traveling man. He was the most traveling man in the land. Traveled everywhere, that's right. Known him for many miles around. Didn't get caught, never got whooped until the police shot him down. Now this boy went down to the spring one day just to get a pail of water. This is said he had to go, couldn't have been more than two dollar miles and a quarter. He got there, got his water, but when he started back, he stumbled and he fell down. He ran to the house, got himself another bucket, go to water if it touched the ground. He was a traveling man, that's right. He certainly was a traveling man. He was the most traveling man that ever was in the doggone land. Traveled everywhere, known for many miles around. Didn't get caught and never got whooped till the police shot him down. Now the boy was on the Titanic ship the day it was going down. He was standing out by the port side, they said, and they had his head hung down. When he did jump overboard, the people all said he was a fool. About two and a half minutes after that, the cat was shooting dice in Liverpool. He was a traveling man. That's right. Certainly was a traveling man. Ooh, he was the most. You know what I'm saying. 
he traveled everywhere. He was known for many. Didn't get caught, didn't get whooped till the police shot him down. Now listen, police shot him with a rifle. Bullet went through his head. People that were coming from miles around to see if they're traveling, they were really dead. The telegram down south where his mama lived, she was all upset, carried away with tears. You know she walked up and opened up the coffin's lid, the fool had disappeared. He was a traveling man. Certainly was a traveling man. Ooh, the boy traveled. Uh-huh. That's right. He traveled everywhere. He was known for many miles around, but he didn't get caught, never got whooped. Till the police shot him. Now listen, the police caught this traveling man at last. They had him up to hang one day. The jury man all asked that traveling man, what in the world did he have to say? He begged the jury man if they would bow their heads, bow their heads in prayer. He crossed his leg and he winked an eye and he went up to there. He was a traveling man. I learned that song from old Pink Anderson down in Spartanburg. The year I didn't go out on with the medicine show, I ended up hanging out with Pink. I, I only wish I got to do the medicine show. I might have had something to talk about up here, but it's not going to happen anymore. There are no more medicine shows. Well, there are, but they're not called medicine shows. Anyway. Whew. Okay, uh, do you another one from the newest album, uh, The Good Book. The wife's over there, the end of the fence there. She's the one with the badge that says Nancy Bookbinder. She's got the CDs, $10 a piece. That means four for 40. <laughs> six different ones. If you buy six, you can have for a $50 bill. Tell her I said it only today, only at this spot. That's really cheap. We're losing money, but how much money does a man need? I'm getting old. Okay, here's a good one from the, the new album. Let me think about it a second here. Drop D. Very observant. Good. Very good. This one here was uh, covered by the uh, Rock and Roll Hall of, Hall of Famer, uh, Yorma Kalkinen, very exciting for me. Woo! Sometimes I do the song at a gig now and somebody says, oh, I love the way you do Yorma's song. You know, they download the stuff, they don't know who wrote it or anything. But I do get the checks. Gonna see Yorma at Merle Fest in a couple of weeks up there. And I'll be teaching at Yorma Kalkinen's Fur Peace Ranch. It's down the road of Fur Peace. I'll be there in October. We're doing Gary Davis Weekend with me and Rory Bach and Yorma Kalkinen. And our buddy Tom Feldman is going to be there too. And the wife's got some of those little uh, brochures about that guitar camp. It costs a lot of money, but uh, save up. It's worth it. This song is uh, a, a tribute to all the guys and gals that used to play the music that are no longer with us. And I call it uh, Another Man or Woman. I've done a full go-round. sound. You can weep and you can moan. That old boy ain't coming home. Another man, another man done a full go round. We can tell our tales, we can laugh and joke. We can ponder all day about the words he spoke. You can run and you can hide. Death come creeping up by your side. Another man done a full go round.
Spread the summer, spring or fall, you got to go where the good Lord calls. Made us laugh until we cried, only wish I had a chance to say goodbye. Another man done a full go round. Yeah, put him in the ground, six feet down. Did you hear that coughing sound? The summer, spring, or fall, you got to go. The good Lord calls. Yes, another man done a full go round. That's right. Tomorrow morning at 9.30, I think, is the, it might be 9 o'clock, heaven forbid, it might be the guitar workshop over at the guitar workshop place. Anybody here going to Merle Fest next month? We got one. Well, I recognize you, Tiger Pants. We'll finish up with this tune here. I call it The Good Book, and it's the title of the new album. And uh, kind of inspired by the playing of uh, Reverend Gary Davis, who I was lucky enough to know pretty well. Passed away May 5th, 1972. Hard to believe. There's a great film out called The Harlem, Harlem, New York. The Harlem Street Singer, a documentary featuring uh, Bob Weir and Yorma Kalkinen and myself and others. And it's a, a documentary on Reverend Gary Davis's life. Uh, uh, Peter Yarrow's in it, and uh, Mrs. Davis, and there's some great clips of Gary Davis at the Newport Folk Festival back in the 60s. He was a monster. He gave us all a career. David Bromberg's in it. He, he was a student of Gary's. Stefan Grossman's in it. He was a student of Gary's. We all hung out and stole what we could. I learned what we could. I didn't learn that much, but I'm having a good time. I just liked hanging out with the old guy, you know? We traveled around the country on and off for two years, and uh, here I am. The good book. Well, Reverend Davis's big churchy chords in there. Gives me chill bumps. I just love this. so much for being here. Thank you. Great job on the sound. The sound people are really good. They make or break the show. This was a good one. It's a gamble every time you get in front of one of these microphones. Watch out for my new live album. It'll be out next month on Peg Leg Records. Roy Bookbinder in concert. Songs of the Road. It's recorded up in Washington, D.C., and it's, it's, I'm really pleased with it. tell you what to do. The good book's got the answers. You just wait and see. The good book's got the answers there just for you and me. Said learn to sing and dance. Ooh, work and play real hard. Better watch your step along the way on your journey to the stars. Don't you 
be a cheater, but don't be telling lies. Straight and narrow path you're on, lead you to the prize. Yes, my mama told me, papa told me too. Good books got the answers, it will tell you what to do. Good books got the answers, you just wait and see. Be good to the children, the old and feeble too. Don't you be doing to others what you don't want done to you. Mind your own business, keep singing a happy song. Soldier in God's army always knows what's right from wrong. My mama told me, papa told me too. The good books got the answers, tell you what to do. Good books got the answers, you just wait and see. That's right. Don't be one what's not yours. Give thanks you got a lot. Never gonna miss what you don't have. Get from them that's got. Fussing and a fighting is not the righteous way. You just best be quiet if you've got nothing good to say. Yes, my mama told me, my papa told me too. Good books got the answers, it'll tell you what to do. Good books got the answers, you just wait and see. Good books got the answers there just for you and me. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bless your hearts. Bless your hearts. It's unbelievable to, uh, to you know, I'm starting to uh, actually uh, get old. It's a weird thing. I don't feel any different. You look in the mirror and you say, holy shit. I'm starting to look like my older brother. It's scary. <laughs> We're having breakfast about five years ago up in New York. He never left. He says, what are you looking at? I said, it's your face. You're really getting old. He said, if you're lucky, you'll look like this someday. I'm a very lucky man. Yes, I am. And nice to be back at the Swanee. And, and, and it's all about you guys. I mean. If you, you 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 seem to have a good time when I'm up here playing wherever I am, but uh, whoa, baby, I'm having a better time. <laughs> Thank you so much. Good old Gary Davis spiritual. First sang this a little church in Harlem when I was a kid. I'm not a kid, but I was just like 20 something. Travel Reverend Davis and his wife said, "Get up here and sing something." I was like, oh, God Almighty, <laughs> trembling. Someday's mighty swell, a sweet little story that I love to tell. Jesus saved my soul from hell, glory, hallelujah. Fire baptized and I'm Holy Ghost filled. Out here to do my master's will. Got to keep moving, can't be still. Glory, hallelujah. Oh, glory, how happy I am. Oh, glory, how happy I am. A soul been washed in the blood of the Lamb. Glory, hallelujah. When I was blind and I could not see, Jesus come and he rescued me, saved my soul from misery, glory, hallelujah. Get back, Satan, get out of my way, I don't want to hear them say, words you say, oh, talk to me, get down. Bye. 
I baptized in them Holy Ghost fills. I'm out here to do my master's will. I got to keep moving. I can't be still. Glory, hallelujah. Whoa, glory, how happy I am. Whoa, glory, hallelujah. Yeah. Soap and washed in the blood of the Lamb. Glory, hallelujah. When I was blind, I could not see. Jesus come and he rescued me. Set my soul to misery. Good glory. Hallelujah, glory how, oh, happy I am, a soul been washed in the blood of the Lamb, glory, hallelujah, why don't you try to sing that, oh, glory how, oh, glory how, happy I am, that's all right, fire baptized in the Holy Ghost field, I'm out here to do my, my master's will, got to keep moving, I can't be still. I said, glory. Hallelujah. Thank you so much.